In three. Two. Hand off, hand off my ass. You guys good? I'm. <laughs> That's not my head. I know. <laughs> In three. <laughs> two. One. What's up, everybody? I'm Big Mike. <laughs> Let's try it again. Buck up. Fuck, dude, you can't. Stop. <laughs> In three, two, no, one. No, I like it, just not now. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> all right, all right. Three, two, one. What's up, everybody? I'm Big Mike. And I'm Brandon. Dude, you just, like, said your just, name. Just, like, all just... right, my name is Clinton, by the way. Nice to meet you guys. And this is Brewheads. You're, You're damn, damn right. right. I'm just gonna, we're gonna fire right into it. We got something from Thimble Island. Uh, this is called Beach Bum Barista. Ooh. I'm gonna tell you. Ooh. So Ooh. much I gotta cover. Uh, <laughs> There's a I lot know. going on on that All right. picture. Uh, it's a limited batch. Limit? Ooh. Limited? Limited. Oh, I, I like that. All right. That means special. Yeah, it does. And I'm special. Yes, you are. Short bus. Ooh. Ooh. All right, here we go. We're just gonna crack it. Crickets! Wait, wait, what were all those sounds you just made? <laughs> you can't, just, wait. No, hang on, time out! We're pouring. Ooh, that's a good color. That smell coming off of this thing, damn. Ooh. All right, so. Color. Color, dirty. 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 The smell? The best level of haze. That was, like, that's not even color. It's like Ooh. yellow, yellow, golden. Ooh. Yellow golden. Yeah. The smell, though. This, this smells beachy. Yeah. Man, Beachy. I, what does that smell like? Because I can't even think. I can't even figure that out. It's got out. like a little pineapple. Obviously a citra type, but yeah, it smells acidic. Yeah, but I get a little pineapple off of it, and a little tropical fruit. Pineapple. I got some pineapple. I got some tropical fruit. I gotta stop smelling. Or I'm gonna For drink. Your sake, there better be pineapple, huh? <laughs> you yeah, damn right there better be some fucking pineapple. I got my mind set on pineapple now. Mmm. Beach. Pineapples. Yeah. Or some mango. No, all right, let's sip no, it. Right. Let's sip it. Give me a sip, guys. Question: Is there pineapple flavor? I don't know. <laughs> oh. There's a lot going on with there, that. There's a lot. There is a lot going on. There's with no that. one. There is some tropical fruit. There's a lot going on just in the yeah, smell. Yeah. Does this, I don't know how to word this. I feel like that this beer has like spices in it. I am with you with that. Do you see what I'm trying to say? It's got not not that it's spicy. No, 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 no. Spice is like But um, it's like seasoned like 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 not seasoned. Not not like tenderizing I, meats. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. It almost has like Montreal a steak <laughs> tropical fruit yeah. to it. Uh, yeah, like um is this a spring summertime no, explosion this is, of this is definitely like aromas. a summer, this is a definitely a some beach yeah like they said yeah this is a beach beer I you got there's tropical, some like pina colada type yeah I I got the island feel not even yeah not no Connecticut beach no no <laughs> I got like I'm in the islands waters blue almost, yeah I I actually almost kind of want to say like a chili powder kind of I did not get chili powder I can. Yeah, it, I'm. I'm. It, I, it's I can see. Not, I can see. Not that it's spicy like ch chili powder. No. But the fla the seasoned flavor of a chili pow a, a chili powder. Th there's multiple layers. Yeah. It's got like a seasoning to it. You not got the, that it's spicy, but it has like the citrus base, and then yeah. like a seasoned tropical fruit. tropical yeah. flute flute tropical <laughs> flute tropical like. Flavor. You know how like some people like Five they'll like on cursive. You know like, like smoke some fruit on the yeah on, on the, the grill. grill. Yeah, it's got kind of that flavor like smoke fruit flavor with a little seasoning to it. There is an, honestly there is an explosion of aromas There's, coming out yeah, of this. Yeah, there is a lot going on with. Wow, this, this, I, I get that that seasoned. Uh, um, I feel like. That seasoned flavor more coincides with what you smell. Yeah. I'm actually, to be honest with you, I'm struggling with this one. Really? 
Yeah. I think this is probably the most complex thimble one hundred percent I've ever had. One hundred percent. I am struggling with this. Like, cause there, I don't know if I like it or hate it. To be honest with you, that's where I'm at. There are so many flavors hmm. with this beer. It's hard to focus on just one. So we agreed that this is definitely summer beach kind of beer. Yeah. Okay. Because yeah, is... smelling this, I feel like I'm on the beach. Definitely blue water, not some ham and acid, low tide kind of yeah. like beach. Yeah. Like blue water, Caribbean style beach. People are walking around the beach with like coconut, you know, what is it, butter or oil? Mm -hmm. I don't know what the fuck coconut. Coconut, coconut oil. Um, and like uh, sunscreen, you're getting all those aromas. Um, just a cornucopia of beach smells. All right, let's see if we can break this down a little. Is this a beer that you would buy again? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know either. I don't know. I, I don't know. That's... Part of me says yes, and part of me is like, no. The majority... I, honestly, because I'm so confused, I feel like I wouldn't. Yeah, because... This one... Yeah, this... I can't even pinpoint flavors, to be honest with you. Let's, let's put it this way. I am... My brain right now is like reboot. <laughs> <laughs> Mike's my, over there just drooling, staring my, at the ceiling, yeah, trying my, to understand what's going on. My brain on. is like, it's it's like trying to update Windows. Reboot now or postpone an hour? <laughs> yeah, it is. Give me another question. Uh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Love to come back. Should that. everyone try this beer at least once? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. Should a person no. who is very hey, heavily that? into craft beer try this once? If, if you don't like surprises. <laughs> no, I think anyone who's like legit into craft beer and yep. loves complex I beers. Feel like that's the only kind yes. of person that's going to drink this. All around overall population? No. No, I, I feel like if you, you, know you hand someone that drinks like Bud Light or something like that on a regular like think, or something like that. They, they, they're going to explode. Oh, they, yeah. I think this is one of those beers that the normal public would be like, eh, that beer was all right. And brewers would like vote it number one. Yeah. Because okay. okay. you know how you have those, like, yep. the brewer, what the because usually what the brewers enjoy is never anything the normal public enjoys. Right. It's, it's almost like, you know, the and same thing with like cars. You know, most people in the car industry never really appreciate the stuff that's like actual number one in sales right you know i, I will say you know every time you t i take a sip and i feel like the name beach bum represents the how you receive the flavors it's almost like a wave crashing and like rotating like you take that sip and it just crashes onto your tongue and then just like the wave goes up the beach and then just dissipates like you know what i'm trying to say like i the way you receive whatever that flavor is, does it yeah. does it vary? Is there more than one flavor in here? Like, does it change every time you sip it? For is me, it all just for constant? Me, it, does it stays the same. It's the, it, yeah. It's just trying to. There's more than one flavor yeah, in here. It's to explain. It's How the, many flavors do you think? I, I, off the top of my head, at least three. I was gonna say five. I was going to say there's at least five different flavors. Ah, that's literally, possible. And you know what? Literally at once. Yeah. That's what makes it so hard okay. to compute. And that at once is what I'm talking about is that crash of the... If this was an Olympic sport, what one would it be? All of them. I'm, triathlon. Yeah, I'm changing that one up. Is it? Triathlon. Okay. This is a triathlon. Okay. All right, I see that. You, you got like five sports in one and... Is there anything you would change about this beer, or is it just this complex Actually, monster you, you that you're what? just like... You know what, in all honesty, I don't think I would change anything about the beer. It would probably take away from it. Okay. Because it's... Uh, this is rollerball. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me I'm wrong. Oh my... <clears throat> how do you even know about... That was the shittiest movie ever made. He doesn't ever. know about the movie, I don't think. He's talking about the sport. Oh, there was, there was yeah. a movie. The there, was movie, there was a movie. There was a movie with LL. Good. Oh, shit, you're right, you're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They kill people. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah no, that's not what I was talking. Oh, about. okay. I was. I immediately went to the movie that was so no, horrible. No, like with the roller like, derby. Maybe that's what I'm thinking. Rollerball? That's a rollerball. You said rollerball. Rollerball yeah. was the movie about roller derby. Yeah, yeah but no, it was no, like I roller like, derby. Yeah. Okay. okay. Like you're just going around in a circle, just throwing bows. <laughs> what music would you associate with this beer? I would have to go with dubstep. No. <laughs> I don't reggae. I would go with Jamaican. Uh, death metal. <laughs> All because right. you have no clue what the fuck is going on. You know what? There's just some crashing, some people bumping into fire somewhere out of nowhere, and you have no clue what the hell is happening right now. See, I said Jamaican music or reggae for the same thing because I have a hard time understanding what they're saying. <sighs> Not. <laughs> what what if it was a death metal reggae? Perfect. All right. One hundred percent. Exactly. <laughs> all right. So this beer is now a uh, it's all it's a triathlon of um, reggae mosh pit death metal. There um, you go. That, that that is the that's beer. That's the best way to describe it. <laughs> you try it and tell us we're, tell us we're wrong. I, <laughs> yeah, I dare you to tell us we're wrong. <laughs> so all right. So, so uh, my rating yeah. on this is a uh, three seven five. Okay. It's it's not bad. It's just it's a it is a complete mindfuck. And uh, it's a it's a beer that makes you think. Yeah. Instead of taking away your your ability to think, this <laughs> makes you think. What do you got? <laughs> no, we'll go with that. <laughs> Shoulder my, shrug. My initial reaction is like a two. Okay. Yeah. Do I feel like that's what it deserves? I feel like it deserves better because of the creativity and everything. I'm still in shock. Yeah. Like, I don't... I don't... My brain, my palate, my stomach doesn't you know, know how to process this. You know, maybe yeah. by the time we actually air this video, he'll... I'm gonna... I'm gonna you know what? I'm gonna go two and a half. Two and a half? I, I mean, I, I don't see myself going out and purchasing this. I okay. don't, and that's how I'm, that's what's gonna, that's really what's making me decide that. But if somebody handed this to me, I would drink it. Um, would I order it in a restaurant? No, because I wouldn't want to pair this with anything, to be honest with you. <laughs> I hear you. That, I, it has too many flavors as is. You add <laughs> yeah. in another one, I think I'd. What do you it. pair with confusion? <laughs> exactly. No. <laughs> I have no idea. Actually, you know what? Hawaiian pizza. Yeah. I can't eat Hawaiian pizza. Yeah. With, yeah. uh, with not ham, but pepperoni. Pepperoni. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. All right. Give it a little spicy kick to it. Oh, yep. you're on something there. Before we run out of battery, I'm going to read this. Um, we'll go back to that. Uh, Thimble Island Beach Bum Barista. Uh, matcha Latte Milkshake IPA. Okay. Sure. What does that mean? I don't know. Gone Surfing. Double dry hopped India pale ale, brewed with lactose with matcha tea added. Oh, okay. Ah, all, right. The, all right. Tea. That's the. Maybe, maybe that's the. <clears throat> maybe that's why it's so freaking. You look up what matcha tea tastes yeah. like. This is, uh. Get a case of. Got a case of the Mondays? Now serving up Beach Bum Barista, a New England style IPA brewed with lactose for a rich, smooth mouthfeel. And whirlpooled with citra hops, double dry hopped with copious amounts of citra and galaxy hops, for an aromatic tropical blast of yeah. key lime, mango, and mango, finished off with earthy and herbaceous ma matcha tea powder. Key lime. Wow. So that's our thoughts <laughs> <laughs> on Thimble Island's Beach Bum yeah. Barista, um, a complex, yeah, hell it's of a really strange complex, milkshake IPA. Yeah. I mean, that's probably why we don't. I mean, I really don't taste key lime. Yeah. But maybe, maybe you guys do. Let us know in the comments. Let us know, yeah. If you ever had, was that maracha tea? Mm. Let us know if you had the tea. Matcha, matcha, matcha latte milkshake IPA. If you've had matcha tea, let us know. And uh, as always, drink responsibly, stay wobbly. See you on the next one. Deuces.